I'm here to talk about NFL hot topics with Toronto Sun football columnist John Crick. We're going to talk about Super Bowl coming up, celebrities. Should they stay? Should they not stay? A lot of celebrities want Maroon 5 not to perform in the Super Bowl. A lot of celebrities have backed out of appearing in Super Bowl ads. What's your take on that, John? I don't think this celebrity thing is going to be a big deal. By the time the Super Bowl rolls around, we might have a two 40-year-old quarterbacks in that game, or we might have a couple of young gunslingers in that game. There seems to be so much momentum going forward for the league with ratings going up on both sides of the border. I expect that by the time the Super Bowl rolls around, uh, especially if some team signs Colin Kaepernick before then, <laughs> that uh, we won't have so much an issue with celebrities talking about boycott. I'd be surprised if it continued. You just mentioned Colin Kaepernick. What's the chances that we see him again this season? Probably low. I mean, it's now been almost two years exactly since he's taken a snap in an NFL game. Whether you're a great player, whether you're a terrible player, that's a long time for somebody not to be in the league uh, and football ready. And not just uh, from a standpoint of how the league might have changed since he last played, but even from a standpoint of whether he's ready and, the, and being fast enough mentally to go into a game and give a team a chance to win. Uh, I got to ask you real quick. The kneeling controversy, has it helped, hurt, has it had any effect? Not this year. Uh, the past two seasons in the NFL in America, ratings went down 10%. Each of those seasons, a lot of people think in large part due to the kneeling controversy and how that has offended so many Americans who grew up in schools giving their mm -hmm. pledge of the, the Pledge of Allegiance to the flag. And a lot of people thought that that would continue this year. With the offensive explosion and other factors, no. In fact, ratings are up not only in the States, uh, at least 3%. Mm -hmm. In Canada, ratings are up 19% so far this season. Let us know what you think down below. Subscribe to our YouTube channel. Tweet us and Facebook us as well. Thanks for watching.